So we had a visitor come to our property today, as you can see here. I'm not an expert, but I'm pretty sure that's a boa constrictor. Pretty decent sized one as well. I uh, didn't think too much of it at first, but then when I considered something else, I wondered if there was more meaning behind this. Uh, during the same week, we found in my children's room a scorpion. It was a black scorpion and it was on my uh, son's side of the bed, right in the spot where he would have put his foot right down on it uh, had he gotten out of bed and we saw it when we were getting ready to, to tuck them in. And the scorpion and the serpent, they have special biblical significance and particularly uh, for me because I once cast out a demon using the verse from Luke that says he has given us the power to trample on serpents and scorpions. And this all happened within a week of the intruder that broke into our property that Jesus warned me about wanted to get into our house. And so putting all the pieces together and especially considering the significance that specific verse has for me, uh, I'm definitely uh, seeing the message of being uh, weary and cautious. We do know our adversary prowls around like a roaring lion looking for who uh, to devour. And certainly our Father in Heaven would understand. He understands everything, but certainly he would understand if I see a serpent and a scorpion very close together. At the same time that's going on, it's certainly uh, causing me to be cautious. And I think that's good advice. Uh, for all of us regardless. Um, certainly anybody who looks at the videos on my website, you know that I wage battle quite openly against the, the forces of spiritual wickedness. And so um, I do think it's important that we pray for protection. I pray for all my brothers and sisters in Christ and ask that you pray for me and my family as well, a, a hedge of protection around us, I think we're going to see more increasing numbers of serpents and scorpions in all of our lives as Christians. And I'm not talking about the literal kind, but the other kind. And uh, I do pray if it's God's will that we do battle with them, if any of them get through, that we may wear the full armor of God, that if they penetrate that hedge, they cannot penetrate us. And I pray that we will tread on those serpents and scorpions if they dare try, because that is what is written in his word and he keeps his promises. And so I pray in the name of Jesus Christ that his word be done, that all of my brothers and sisters in Christ, that we will tread upon every serpent and every scorpion that enters our lives. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen.